Hi friends, Krista here. Thanks for stopping by Books and Jams. I am here at the gardens with my little dude and it is time for another weekend reading vlog. I am not sure how this is gonna work and if I will stop at the end of the weekend or not. I know that for my patrons, I'm gonna vlog my whole week being gone at Nicaragua, but I think I'm just gonna do the weekend for everybody, um, just like normal. So it's Friday and today is packing day because at three in the morning tonight, I need to go be at church for our bus to the airport because we're leaving to, for Nicaragua on Saturday morning very early. It has been raining last night and this morning and so all the paths are a little wet and mossy and a little bit slick. So we're okay. We had a little fall. <laughs> so we are going to check. You see what? Oh, nice. Yeah, nice. Yeah, good spotting. Um, we're going to check on our turtle head plant and going for a little walk on the woods and little dude has rain boots on so he can splash in any puddles that we find along the way. Tonight, I, like I said, today is pack day. Um, because I have to leave so early, I'm gonna try to get in bed at like seven. So it won't be very exciting today. Hey, Fishes Fish in there. Oh, lots of them. Look at them all. Good noticing. So today's pack day. I'm, my goal is to be packed and ready, everything by the door by 7 p.m. so that I can go lay down maybe listen to an audiobook, just relax my eyes, be in bed, try to sleep a little early because I'm waking up at two. Ooh, that's gonna come so early. So that's the plan for today. I will check in with you later. It's one of those days where my glasses just keep fogging up because it's so, um, so much moisture in the air. <laughs> so every time I sit for a second, it fogs right up. But we're still enjoying the gardens this morning. It's a lovely, Lovely day. It's much cooler than it has been. I'm enjoying it because as soon as I get to Nicaragua, it's going to be toasty warm. <laughs> All right. Oh my goodness. It has been a busy afternoon. I am home just getting home from work and then running some errands. I had to go to the chiropractor one last time and then stop at Target to grab travel size things and Q-tips and just a little bit of this and that for the trip. Now it's time to get serious. <laughs> it is almost two o'clock and my goal is to be in bed by seven. If I want to be ready to sleep if I can. So I'm going to try to be in bed by seven. So I have five hours to do laundry, to totally pack, clean up my house enough that I feel comfortable leaving for a week, water the plants, like all the little nitty gritty. I have a video to edit as well. So that is the plan for the next five hours. So we'll see if I can get everything done. I may start an audiobook because I don't have one going right now. It needs to be something light and fluffy. I do have, I believe, a couple rom-coms saved on Scribd. Scribd is really dumb right now, though. And most of the books that I have saved are not available until August 10th. I don't know why it does that. So I only have eight choices currently saved on Scribd. And I normally have like 30 something books saved on script. So it's a little frustrating because I can't start the Poisonwood Bible, which is on my TBR. And I wanted to read that this month, but I won't be able to start till the 10th. I have another book that was on my TBR for this month, At Home in Mitford, I think. Enough, I think I have that on Holden Libby. I don't know, but I'm kind of bummed just because not all the books that I have been saving to listen to are available to me. I guess I listened to too many audiobooks and script is like, slow your roll, Krista, slow your roll. <laughs> so it's time to get going. I grabbed Panera for lunch and dinner. Actually, I grabbed a you pick too. I'm going to eat the sandwich now and save the salad for dinner. So that's a little fun. And I'm in the Sips Club right now. I did this last summer too. So I get free drinks. I pay like $9.99 a month and I get as many of these free drinks of their charged lemonades as I want and they're delicious. So it's a sugary drink and I don't do it all year round, but it's a nice birthday slash summer treat. I started in July. I think last year I did three or four months of it and because I forgot to cancel. I think I will cancel at the end of August and just do it for the rest of the summer. Maybe September. Maybe I'll go through September too. We'll see. 
But, all right, I've got a lot to do. I'm going to go use my mirror in my room as my whiteboard and I'm going to make my lists. One list for things I need to pack, one list for things I need to do, and then I'm going to probably do a version of sprints because I have editing to do. So I'll sit and edit for a bit and then get up and clean for a bit and back and forth until it's all done. Let's go! All right, I got the first thing crossed off my list. This is my living room, my front door, and there was all kinds of stuff. I just needed to be cleaned up. I watered the plants, I dusted everything, cleaned up, and this room is now done. Yay! All right, first thing off the list. Living room, still need to do dishes, water the rest of the plants. What does that say? Edit and upload my July. Wrap up working on that, get my comments down to zero, my email under 10, and then there's my packing list. Hair, nails, shoes, undies, <laughs> Sunday clothes, toiletries, chargers, and cords, and my Kindle. Yep. And here is the process. <laughs> so the goal is everything is going to fit in this bag and this bag. That's all like toiletry stuff, so that'll be combined, and I'm doing my second load of laundry now. I think I have almost all my shirts, but I just need like the rest of the bottoms and then the trick is to make it all fit in this carry-on. I can do it. All right, room number two is done. Watered these plants. Here's my plant tour, ready? Some kind of pothos, another kind of pothos. Oh, did not dust. <laughs> There's a spider plant that used to live up top here, but now I put too many puzzles and games up here. I have a Christmas cactus that's kind of pathetic. I don't know what this one is. And there's that one. Man, any of you that have a green thumb are probably <laughs> croaking. And then this is my jungle. <laughs> I have a little stand there and I just stuffed all my plants on there because this is the only window in my house that gets direct sunlight. So these need some TLC for sure, but I have a couple different, one, two, three more pothos. I don't know what this guy is, but he's reaching for the light. Good job, buddy. This is like, Transcendia, I forget what it is, but he's a he's a traveler. He's kind of he's kind of all over. The ones up close are pretty pathetic, so I need to kind of repot and fix fix that up a bit. This guy is this this one here. He's growing nicely. He's got a big stem coming off of him. I'm not sure what that is, but he's going. Part of it has died. <laughs> that is an old one. <laughs> I've got this, oops, I've got this tall dude here. Probably needs a bigger pot than what he's got. Yeah, underneath is all ones that need to get trimmed off. And then another one of these, this is the same as, as this one. Another one of those. And another, trend, whatever this is called. I don't like the name Wandering Jew. That's another name for this plant, but I don't like that name, but he's definitely a viney guy. <laughs> Here's my jungle. They're all watered and ready for me to be gone for a bit. Anyone else add things to their list just so they can cross them off? I just vacuumed, so yay for that. I watered the plants and I answered all my comments. So that is finished. I'm making really good progress. I did my email is done. I still have to finish editing and I did the dishes. And I've started packing. So hair stuff, nope, nails, nope, shoes. I did put socks in, so that's in there. <laughs> Undies I got, I got my Sunday outfit. Toiletries are done. Chargers, no, Kindle, no. So I'm making good progress. Here's the, that bag is gonna be that stuff. Well, the bubbles are gonna go into a checked bag, but that bag is almost done. The Kindle and the chargers will also go in there. And then all of my clothes are in here, hats, some some snacks, which I'll probably end up taking out of the box. But yeah, I look at how clean my bed is. I got to make a copy of my passport to leave here with Jordan and a copy to put in both of my bags. I'm making progress, almost done. It's six o'clock. The goal is to be done by seven. So I think I can do it. I think I can do it. All right, I'm gonna sign off for the night. I just came outside for a few minutes and I'm getting bit already, which 
It's kind of a precursor to what's to come, I think. So I'm not packed yet. It's eight o'clock. I wanted to be in bed an hour ago. It didn't happen. It took me longer than an hour to edit my July wrap up, which will be going up on Monday before this will for sure. Um, it just took me a long time to get that edited and ready to go, but it's all up. Now I need to go finish packing. I have everything almost ready. I just need shoes and all my chargers and Kindle and my power bank that I bring. I realized I forgot to go to the bank. <laughs> I was supposed to go to the bank to get kind of some crisp, to get some crisp bills. I think I might have enough. So I'm gonna double check what I've got, hopefully that's enough. Otherwise, I'll probably just have to use an ATM at the airport or something tomorrow, which isn't ideal, but it is what it is. I just forgot to do that when I was out running errands this afternoon. But I feel like I got a lot done today. My house feels clean and ready for me to be gone. Jordan is still here, so I didn't do like the bathroom and take out all the trash and stuff, but he's still here, so he could do some of that. I just didn't want to leave it a total mess for him. So, yeah. I'm really bummed because I had ordered myself two pairs of Capri pants from Amazon. They were supposed to arrive on Tuesday and something happened with the shipping and they ended up back at Amazon and I was refunded the money, which is a real bummer. Thankfully, I had enough pairs of shorts that work and like Capri workout pants and stuff that work. So I'm, I'm good, but I was really bummed because they were a little like nicer. <laughs> because uh, what I have is pretty sporty and whatever, and that's fine. Uh, but I was just looking forward to having some different options. But I'm, I'm pretty well packed, just like I said, shoes and chargers and all the little nitty gritty, making sure it all fits in the bag. But the goal is now to be in bed in the next half hour, which isn't bad, obviously. I mean, we're not leaving. I don't have to be at church until 3 a.m. So I've got time. I just was hoping to get a little bit of shut eye. <laughs> Who knows if I'll be able to shut my brain off anyway enough to sleep, but we shall see. Oh yeah, I can't forget like a Bible and a journal and a pen. Like I need all that stuff too. I need to go through my list. I have a list of what to pack and the lessons I'm teaching. Oh my word, I need that too. <laughs> so I've got a, quite a few things I need to still gather, um, but I'm going to go through the list that they gave us of what to pack and make sure I just have everything covered. I'm pretty close. So 30 minutes, I think I can do it, but I'm going to sign off for the day here because tomorrow is going to be a really long day. So I'll talk to you tomorrow. <laughs> Good night. Good morning. Happy Saturday. Yeah, well, these are, uh, it's 2.30. No, is, what time is it? 3.15. We're at church. It's hard to see everybody. It's pretty dark. I'm standing in the window. We're about to head out. Yay. You call me, you can have fun, and I'll talk to you again. You don't think you need to be. few people get their bags checked but it's hot and we're about to get in the van and head to the mission house yay <laughs> there's robin ready to go <laughs> oh, is everybody here becky 
<laughs> Count the kids. Count off. We should have numbers. Everybody yep. have your number. Yeah, that's what you do. <laughs> This is the this is the single ladies room. Cindy's my my bunk mate, and we have one other. Robin, there's only three of us in here, so we get this nice big room. There's like two, one, two, three, four sets of bunk beds, and then these two doors are two bathrooms. So we are set, and there's AC in here. Thank you, Lord. <laughs> this is the market building. Thank you. Time to do some shopping. <laughs> this is called we're done shopping <laughs> and we've been up since 2 the 2 30 this morning <laughs> go to the market they said it'll be fun they said <laughs> sorting out all the stuff that we brought, donations and stuff. You'd probably appreciate it if I would quit <laughs> walking in front of your camera. <laughs> Good morning, happy Sunday from my bunk. <laughs> I was going to go outside and kind of walk around the grounds a little bit with you this morning. Was hoping that nobody else was really up, but I went and found a good spot to sit and do my quiet time. And a couple guys from my team came right over and sat down too. They went to get coffee and, and saw me walking over. So they came and sat, so that was totally fine. We just chatted for a little bit. Um, today, Sunday, we are headed to a church nearby and I will be doing the kids lesson. Someone else from the team is gonna be doing the preaching for the day. And then we're gonna do a feeding program. We're gonna feed people at church and then we're also gonna give away food bags that the pastor has designated for a certain number of families, 75 families, I think. Or we have 75 to give away. We'll see how many we give away today. And then we're gonna come back here and have lunch and chill out for a little bit. And then we're headed to a volcano today. So that will be pretty cool. And today is the last of our kind of abnormal days. The rest of the week, Monday through Thursday, we're going to the same neighborhood. We're gonna do the same things. We're building houses, we're doing kids programs, all that. You're gonna miss out on that for this vlog. Uh, my patrons will get to see a little bit more of that. But yeah, today should be a good day. I already got <laughs> eaten up by bugs, so I had to come back in the room and get some bug spray on uh, because they're no joke down here. So I'm gonna, go, I'm gonna head out. We're about to go have breakfast and get the day started. Yay. Yes. Thank you. Gracias.
it is the end of the day Sunday. I feel like I'm starting and ending the day in the same spot. But I think uh, it's a little early for bed for me, but I came in to have a shower and relax in my room and go to bed early because I did not sleep so great last night. So I'm just taking a minute to go over my lesson for tomorrow. I am also teaching tomorrow and then I get a break on Tuesday and Thursday. So I'm teaching Sunday, Monday, Wednesday, but it should be pretty good. It's a different lesson though than today, different group of kids, but also a different lesson. So I am going to be teaching. Oh, my roommates are coming in. <laughs> and then I'm going to read for a little bit and then go to bed early. So I already had a shower, nice cold shower. Felt wonderful, actually. It felt fantastic. And now I'm just chilling. But thank you so much for watching this weekend of excitement. And I would love to chat with you down in the comments. And if you are a patron, you guys get to look forward to the rest of the week as well. But for everyone else, this is it. Let's chat in the comments and I will talk to you in another video very soon. Bye.